This is the Phoenix, Arizona weather discussion for Friday, April 14th. I'm Michael Groff. It's springtime in the southwest, and you know what that means? Dry and warm. Very little chance of rain, and that is what our forecast looks like for the next 7 to 10 days. Let us discuss. As we look outside this morning, clear skies in the valley at 6.45 a.m., we start the day out at 63 degrees at Sky Harbor. Dew point at 34, humidity 34%. The winds are light. The barometer is rising. Temperatures across the area this morning, upper 40s for Fort McDowell. Most of us, though, here in south central Arizona are in the mid 50s to mid 60s. A few clouds in extreme southeast Arizona right now. Otherwise, mostly clear skies out there. The watch warning map is extremely quiet for mid April. So winter weather advisories, parts of Idaho and Montana, some red flag advisories, sections of New Mexico, Colorado. Otherwise, just not a whole lot to talk about out there. On the convective outlook, a marginal risk of severe storms today, extending from the Rio Grande Valley all the way up to the Minnesota-Iowa border. The standard slight risk to include places like Amarillo, up toward Dodge City, Garden City, Liberal, Kansas. And as far as our weather, let's talk about it in more detail. As we look at the models, here's the GFS, the 06Z run, valid at 5 o'clock Mountain Standard Time today. A trough passing well north of Arizona, flattening out the ridge. Mainly a zonal flow will be brought in here today. Some breezy conditions in Southern California and along the river. Otherwise, mostly sunny skies, a little cooler than yesterday. We'll be in the upper 80s to about 90. Tonight, we're clear and mild lows, mid-50s to mid-60s. Tomorrow... Same as today, mostly sunny, upper 80s to about 90. Easter Sunday looks like a mostly sunny day. Could see a few high clouds. Highs about 90. Same on Monday. We're changing the maps, I promise you that, but the weather just isn't changing at all. Near 90, same for Tuesday. And then on Wednesday, a trough begins to move on to the west coast. This will ultimately impact our weather. So again, another round of breezy weather picking up in southeast California. We'll still be mostly sunny, though, and have highs, lower 90s. On Thursday, that trough moves through the Intermountain West. It's moving mainly over land. The trajectory will not favor any precipitation. We will see an increase in wind. Breezy to locally windy conditions on Thursday. Temperatures mid to upper 80s. Then, this is a week from today, Friday, the 21st of April. That trough passes us by. Does not look to be nearly as deep or impressive as what we were seeing on previous model runs. Temperatures, though, should still fall back into the low and middle 80s. Here's Saturday the 22nd. High pressure rebounding here in the southwest. Warmer conditions will be back toward 90. And then this is the end of the forecast period, Sunday, April 23rd. And this, again, looks like high pressure firmly in control. Dry weather, highs low to middle 90s. Looking at numbers off of the GFS Ensemble, we might see temperatures falling back a bit late next week, but otherwise, highs getting dangerously close to the century mark by the end of the month. A brief programming announcement. Now that we are firmly in the dry season, we'll be scaling back our weather video discussions to a five-day schedule, Monday through Friday, until about July 1st or whenever the monsoon starts. Of course, if any inclement weather does threaten us between now and then, we'll have discussions on the weekends, naturally. So uh, we'll return to our seven-day schedule again, monsoon time and continue through the summer. And that should about do it for the Phoenix, Arizona weather discussion for today. Our next video back here Monday morning. Have a great weekend, everybody. Happy Easter. Be safe out there, and we'll see you next week.